I'm Anthony Evans. I was born and brought up in Pembrokeshire, so now I'm based in Penarth. My first donation was in Haverford West when I was a school student. I guess the decision to become a blood donor came from being in school with older guys, playing rugby with older guys who gave blood. It just seemed like an obvious thing to do. When I receive notification of a donation session, I book a time slot if I can. The staff have it down to a fine art. You arrive, you're given the information, the questionnaires are filled out, which are all very clear. And if you're not sure of anything, there's always somebody there to help. Then you go for probably the most painful bit of it, which is when they put that little needle into your finger to take that tiny drop of blood. They test your blood and that you're fine to give that day, and then they insert a needle. Chit-chat that goes on during the giving blood process tends to take your mind off everything completely. And before you know it, somebody's coming along and saying, that's it, Mr. Evans, the bag's full. We'll take you off for a cup of tea and a nice biscuit. The best thing about being a blood donor is a slightly unashamed smug feeling that you've done something which is undeniably good. It's cost you absolutely nothing. The blood you've given is replaced in your body magically by the powers of nature. And within half an hour, it's as if you haven't done anything at all, but for the lovely smug feeling. When I meet people who have never given blood, my first question is always why? And I understand there are genuine reasons, and I respect that. But I would say to anybody who is afraid of the process, who says they're afraid of needles, come and give blood. It's such a necessity. The blood that you give will almost undoubtedly save somebody's life. Giving blood is a simple choice. You give blood, you save a life, job done.